Welcome to Landry Anka on YouTube, here to help you break through those fears and live an awesome life. So I have a very big secret for you today. Oh, maybe it's not so secret. Have you ever noticed the secret is always, everybody knows what the secret is? There are no secrets, but I'm gonna tell you one that I use that is so critical to anyone's manifesting what they desire. All right, and I'm gonna tell you why it's so easy for me to manifest the things that I desire. There are no blocks between me and that which I desire. Now, if you saw my other video about my secret about manifesting, and that is, I don't believe there's anything out there that is manifesting for me. I believe that I'm doing it here and that that out there shows up, all right? That's my secret, and my secret is that I don't have a barrier between that which I desire and what shows up. In other words, when I decide on something and I see it in my mind and I know it in my heart that this is what I desire, there are no other feelings or beliefs that are in opposition to that. That's major. That is my major secret, so I'm gonna tell you something right now. If you are saying something, mantras, wanting something, and you are in conflict anywhere in there, you believe that there's something out there that has control, or that you don't deserve it, or that you struggle with it all the time, and you believe that you struggle with it all the time, and that's just how things are. That's a block, all right? That's a block. You don't believe you hold the power, you don't believe that that thought is manifesting right then, and you may not believe that you really can have it. I always believe I can have it. When I think about something, I'm just thinking about it. There's no, there are no other thoughts that are in there. But I'd say the majority of people don't manifest what they desire, even though they truly want it. They're like, no, 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 I really do want it. I do feel positive about it. I'm thinking, well, that's okay. But I know somewhere you just don't believe it. Your, your parents, somebody said, you know, how do I get my parents to stop talking negatively about money? You don't. That's their reality, it doesn't have to be yours. There's always gonna be people who talk ne negatively about it, whether it's your parents or not. It doesn't mean that you have to believe that. They're gonna struggle for the rest of their lives. They are actually manifesting their life. What you speak and believe, you manifest. So when I speak, I believe it. Because I know everything's possible. I know that I have no limits. You don't have any limits. Everything, we're doing everything. Every horrible thing that's happened on this planet has been manifested by us. All of it. People come from a, play, a place of pain and lower frequencies, so there they you know, impose their anger on others, abuse, all kinds of nasty stuff's going on. Other people are doing that to each other, right? And people do it to themselves, too. And we have to participate as a collective to make it happen. You can't have poverty if, if they're... If, if the collective makes sure that everybody has food on their table, oh, well, where's the poverty coming from? We as a collective aren't taking care of each other. So there is great distortion in what's going on out there. And we believe that there's some other force or groups of people when we're actually the absolute source of everything. I think it, boom, it's manifesting. There's no delay. There's no law of attraction. I'm going to attract and I'm going to use the term law of attraction all day long, but it is not how people believe and think it is, and that's why it doesn't work for them. Law of attraction, they believe, I ask for something out there, it's gonna come to me, and then you're not resonating on the frequency, and it's absolutely impossible for it to come to you. Let's talk about the elevator, right? You're resonating here, it's up here, you cannot attract that up here in this frequency down to where you are. You must be on that frequency. So I am, on this frequency where that thing that I desire is. There's no block between us. There, there, I don't have 20 floors between me and that which I desire. Oh, I don't deserve it, or that's impossible. How am I gonna get it? No, 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 not happening, man. It is not happening. Boom, you're up there. You're on that floor. This is what I desire in here that's loaded with abundance, that's loaded with amazing things. And there are things that are gonna come along with that because we're human beings lessons and things that we have to clear up. So maybe something happens along the way and you think, ooh, there is a block that I must work on. 
All right, so here's a here's a challenge. You know, for me it was patience. The other day is like I got challenged and I was so patient and I stood there and I said, "I'm going to practice patience here." I was presented this opportunity purposely and I practiced patience and boy did it feel good. So, if things happen along the way, those are just things you must work on and clear up. It's like the universe is saying, this has to be handled first. Oh, okay, I'm going to be kinder. Or, okay, I'm going to think kinder of myself. Or, okay, I can be rich. And then, okay, hey, do I really need to be rich? Or do I just want to be happy and have abundance? The things that I desire when I desire them. Because I don't want to go on a lower frequency of ego. I want to be on a high frequency of giving and loving, enjoying my life. And that doesn't mean you have to have crazy, you know, wealth. That means you will have exactly what you need when you need it. That's it. You're in a happy, happy place. My secret. No barriers. Boom. What do I want now? Boom. I can sit here and name stuff that's mind-blowing. That happens within hours of me. I'm, I've got one in mind now that's pretty huge, pretty huge. So I know that there's some things that I have to do to get to that place. So I have to assist the universe because in order to have this certain thing, there are certain things that need to be in alignment that I physically have to do. So I'm having fun doing that. It's like, okay, good. This is the fun part of the journey to obtain that thing, which I know is exists for me right now and it's going to happen. So I must get these things in alignment. And then you do it and you have fun. You don't sit there and go, well, isn't it happy? And you're like, okay, you haven't done anything to make it happen. And that's supposed to be the fun part. This is getting there, right? No obstacles between you and, and what you desire. Because you're going to be saying, I want, I desire, I have. And you got vision boards and all this stuff. And, and you're going, I don't, I don't, I don't, I can't. Why am I not? I never. And then, oh, it's not coming when I want it to. It just doesn't work. doesn't work. Manifesting 24-7. What do you mean it doesn't work? You're manifesting right now. What are you thinking? Oops, do my three-second manifesting. What am I thinking? What am I manifesting? Boom, let's go over to positive one. People tell me it's one second. When they catch it, it's one second. For me, it was like three seconds. It's like, because you've got to catch yourself. It may take a second or two for you to catch that negative thought. That's the most important part. That's what you're manifesting. I don't have those thoughts. I'm always over here. Boom, 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 boom. You like that? Boom. Let's manifest. You're whole and perfect, strong and powerful, loving, harmonious, and happy. Blessings to you, my friend. Hey, I hope I don't have uh, spinach in my tea. Oh, i got to show you this. Hold on. Look what I got in the mail today. Raising the frequency of the planet. One light being at a time. Then it has my name. But this is the sign of infinity. This is all probabilities. This is ascension. It is amazing. And I didn't know that till after I saw it in my head and I had my team create my logo. So if you're interested, all my, um, my merchandise is below. All right? So let's get busy. Let's raise the frequency of the planet. Let's get you in a place you want to be. And thus, the entire planet will benefit from that. Let's do it on a higher frequency, one of love and compassion. You're amazing. Blessings to you, my friend. Namaste.